judge a true Grey Warden. Heroes, then. Saved us all a while back. A sad lot, their lives. Can't get much sadder. There's no one to judge, right? Yes, I know. I'm sure there's plenty of things I need to talk to people about, but I, right now I just wanted to kill some dragons and do some things. I think I, I still need to give away the loot I got from this last dragon hunt. I could go to the ball now. Okay. Um... Mm. Tempted. Here for a favor. No. 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 Optimal cutting. Ooh, I could hear that too. Hmm. Oh, advanced focus. Oh, or true grit. Or the mage or the rogue or the warrior schematics. Oh, shoot. This one's tough. I mean, I basically have what I want for the rogue stuff. Hmm. Let's see what we get if we do the mage schematics. It saved when we came into Skyhold, so I think anyway. Hopefully, it doesn't we don't overwrite it. Oh boy! Well, let's go see what that is. Let me out, let me out. Oh, my floors are fading in. I really do want to get the attachments to my current throne. The pen is mighty. Okay. Oh, dang, take that hat off, or I will just shoot you. We got distracted, and I'm not paying attention. What? Oh, Gaul, his face did that thing again. What did I get? I got the superior enchanter. What's the difference between the enchanter code and the enchanter armor? Is there? There is not a difference on Dorian. Yeah, you know what? You know what? I'm gonna get. Oh, wait. Uh, maybe that one. I'm gonna get the true grit. Or, no. I'm gonna get the fade, the advanced focus thing. Yes, yes. Render in. Render in, house. Come on. So we get to see the Temple of Durthamon, the Elgarnon's Bastion, the Silae's Shrine, Mythal's Temple, the Fenharel Shrine. Only 10 years ago. Maybe 11 now. Freaking Trespasser takes place two years after the events of Inquisition. I guess it could be. I don't know how long the events of Inquisition are supposed to have lasted. I feel like they would. It would. It should probably happen pretty quick. But advanced focus. Yeah, I want it. Okay, let's see. Our soldiers handled themselves well in Adamant. We've come a long way since Haven. I fear there's still a ways to go. Yeah. Grey Warden scoured the area as requested. Unfortunately, it's unprepared when mercenaries working for the Marquis attacked by surprise. Uh. Oh. The Grey Wardens have taken losses, but their morale remains high. The royalty is the Inquisition undisputed. Blah, 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 blah. 
Uh, okay, I do want to do this one. I think, I think I, what do I have? I have them as warriors in this one. But it looks like she might be, oh yeah, Marquis Buffoon. Oh. That Dalish elf who joined us, <laughs> eager to say the least. The Dalish possess great knowledge. We should be honored to have him with us. Uh, Liliana says that, I think, because the... She was... Oh, yeah. She was in... I think she liked the Grey Warden, and in this one she was a Dalish elf. That's just so much effort and time. Stop war. College of Magi. Oh. Right, Cumberland. Right, right, right. Holy crap. Oh, looks like Cullen is the best, but I think Liliana is actually the best. Yay! <laughs> no, 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 no. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna milk this one as long as we can. Right. Okay, go get him, Liliana. You're the shortest. Let's see what's over here. Oh, yes. Okay. Whew. Uh, I brought the Dalish forces into the city. Uh, Dalish are seen as heroes on Wycombe. They remain in the city, uncertain of what to do next. Okay. Whew, okay, I know, I actually looked it up. I knew that was going to go okay, but I was still... Oh, celebrate the... Tell me you sent soldiers to collect the grizzly remains. We have nobles clamoring to see the head up close. I should have anticipated this. Caulking is for peasants, but it will become civilized when done with a glass of wine in one hand and a fan in the other. And another from Ferelden signed Haren. My associate weighs known throughout Theta's first talent at capturing the glory of the Draconic and the armor. Wait! Oh! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Uh, <laughs> no. They are troublesome. Uh. I don't think he actually gives us anything. I'll have to double check. I think I was really bummed out with what actually... He oh yeah, cool! Okay. Gathering coin, locate heretic sister. And that's right. Um. Hmm. I feel like I'm part of the Dark Brotherhood again. Yeah, I don't really see why... Honestly, I don't see why I should get involved in this. It's not like she asked me to do anything. I'm not the maker's instrument, either. I don't know. To work? At first I was thinking about doing it, but the more I look at it, the less I care. Oh, shoot. Okay, you go ahead. 
We'll see how that turns out. Oh man, I'm thirsty. Give the amulet to Cole. Let's go. We'll do that really quick. See how that goes. I forgot we had done that. I'm sorry, Cole. We will get you your amulet and then you will feel better about that whole situation. Because I understand it's very stressful. Have you seen otherwise? Of course. Ooh, my favorite song. Have I not picked that up? He was the boy who was supposed to die. He named himself after the horse. Um... I don't know what that's from. I found the amulet that Solus told us about. Would you like to try it on? Yes. But not here. I like it here. We need some place that can go away if it becomes sharp. Okay. Uh, what? Do you what? Want to do with it? You found one of the amulets. Excellent. May I? What was he doing, Solus? Ah, freaking gosh! It is simple enough. You put it on, I charge it with magic, and you should be protected. We know it's not just going to work, right? It never just works. <laughs> Have faith, Inquisitor. Stopping blood mages from binding me like the demons at Adamant. But it didn't work. Something is interfering with the enchantment. Something like Cole not being a demon? Solus, is it possible that the amulet doesn't work on Cole because he's too human? Regardless of Cole's special circumstances, he remains a spirit. Yes. A spirit who is strangely like a person. I don't matter. Just lock away the parts of me that someone Solus else. Solus is very concerned. Follow. Focus on the amulet. Tell me what you feel. Warm, soft blanket covering, but it catches tears. I'm the wrong shape. There's uh, something. Cole? There. That way. We'll find whatever is preventing the amulet from working, and we'll make it right. All right, kid. Get Cullen and work with him on the map to figure out where you're sensing something wrong. Will you come with me? All of you? Of course! Sure. Cole's favorite people. All right, I get it. You like spirits. But he came into this world to be a person. Let him be one. If I see a way to protect Cole without taking away whatever <laughs> he is, I'll Yes! Win. But Cole clearly needs our help. I'm not saying we do nothing. But that ritual of theirs only works on demons, right? This is not some fanciful story, child of the stone. We cannot change our nature by wishing. Ah. Uh. You don't think. However, we deal with the problem. Ah. Uh. Our next step is to track down whatever is interfering with the enchantment. People pointed out that regardless of if you romance Solus or not, when you say we can't change our nature by wishing it, and Varric says you think. Um, Solus looks at you, the Inquisitor, because you change everything. I 
I didn't realize it was going to be quite this long. I hope the recording yeah, doesn't explode. Yeah, get me through the month. But give me a moment. Why did he think we were coming to talk to him? Greetings. Can I help you? You. You killed me. What? I don't... I don't even know you. You forgot. You locked me in the dungeon in the spire, and you forgot, and I died in the dark. The spire? Cole, stop. Just take it easy, kid. He killed me. He killed me. That's why it doesn't work. He killed me, and I have to kill him back. Before anyone gets killed, I need to know what's going on. Cole, this man cannot have killed you. You are a spirit. You have not even possessed a body. A broken body, bloody, banged on the stone cell, guts gripping in the dark, dank. A captured apostate. They threw him into the dungeon in the spire at Valroyo. They forgot about him. He starved to death. I came through to help. And I couldn't. So I became him. Cole. If Cole was an apostate, that'd make the guy we just saw a Templar. Must have been buying Lyrium. Let me kill him. I need to. I need to. No, Cole. We're like, uh, let's all chat about this. So listen, we cannot let Cole kill the man. I don't think anyone was going to suggest that, Chuckles. Cole is a spirit. The death of the real Cole wounded him, perverted him from his purpose. To regain that part of himself, he must forgive. Come on, you don't just forgive someone killing you. You don't. A spirit can. Barrick? The kid's angry. He needs to work through it. The spirit does not work through emotions. It embodies them. But he isn't a spirit, is he? He made himself human. And humans change. They, they get hurt. And they heal. <sighs> he needs to work it out like a person. You would alter the essence of what he is. He already does that. He to himself when he left the Fade. I'm just helping him survive it. Before I decide anything, I need a clearer picture of what happened. It seems the real Cole was an apostate, captured and taken to the Circle by Templars. Who aren't known for their gentle nature. As the young man starved to death in a dungeon, his pain caught the attention of a spirit, likely one of compassion. Compassion? An uncommon spirit, certainly, and all too fragile when its efforts to help proved to be in vain. Okay. This, I decided in the beginning I would, since Cole is good either way, I last time I, I thought Cole will become more like a spirit, but I feel like it fits for Talon just because of what he said, especially in the conversation just, just prior with when we were still at Skyhold with, uh, with Varric and stuff. He seems to side with Varric. He's like, I need to protect Cole without hurting him. You know, and I feel like Talon would appreciate the fact that we all need to grow. Like, at the time, you probably don't know. You don't really know that he's going to become more human and become more spirit like. You just think that Cole needs to maybe not forgive this, but he needs to be able to move past this pain. If he is going to stay in this world, this is how it needs to be. I'm not saying it very well. I don't know. It's just. Cole, Cole needs to grow. Like, he can't, like, I think it's unfair to force him to remain static in some ways. Like, uh, either way is fine, but for Talon, I think it would be, I think Talon would think it would be unfair to force him to, to do this other thing, too. Like, I think Varric makes a lot of really good points that Talon would agree with. Talon's a bit more practical, and I feel like he would maybe think Solus is perhaps trying to put Cole into a mold that 
isn't necessarily what Cole wants, but Cole doesn't really mind either way, it seems. But yeah, we're gonna we're gonna see how this goes. Cole will never grow into a real person until he comes to terms with what happened. Leave it to me. All right, kid. You want revenge? Come with me. Varric is such a good dad. Yeah, I just try to run. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Sorry isn't going to help him now, is it, kid? No. Pull the trigger and put him down like a mad dog. With a with Bianca. Do it. Go. I think in the other way, you do make him forget, you forgive him, but I like that. I think Varric makes some very good points. Because Cole isn't just a spirit, but he isn't just a human, you know? He's Cole, he's unique. He's a spirit who took on a physical form. I don't know how it's going to affect him, per oh, se. No. The amulet will now never function. Cole remains vulnerable to binding. No, he isn't. The amulet didn't work because he's too human, right? Maybe now the kid's also too human for that binding magic to work on him. I hope you're right. It still hurts. When do I stop hurting? It's okay! Being with your friends can make you feel better. Come on, kid. Let's go for a walk. It'll clear your head. The left hand misses a friend with two different names. She's hurting, sad, alone. But everyone can see me now. They remember. How do I put honey in Leliana's wine without her noticing? I can help with that. It is good that he's not entirely changed, however human he becomes. I'm interested to see how Solus reacts to this as well, maybe. That was tough. That was a tough one, though. It really was. It's, uh... Oh, is Solus not here? Solus isn't here. Strange. But this will be interesting to see how Cole reacts to everything, to to how Solus and Varric react with him. Oh, man. That's the thing is I was worried about Cole being less spirit-y so he can't read people as well. He can't do the things he normally does as well. I don't know. Well, but we'll see. He's going to be good as a human either way, I think. As a human or more spirit-like. And part of the spirit thing made me actually quite sad. And I'm interested to see how he'll react to being more human. And, and, and if, if there's something for him in the future. I don't know. Like, I don't know. Like, in future games or something, how would it play out or something? I don't know. It's interesting. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, I'm not being very articulate. It's really late at night right now. But, mm, I don't know. It's going to be good either way. I'm a little bit nervous, but I think it, it's going to be good either way. So, anyway, thank you guys again for joining me. I'll see you in the next one.